Hello students, welcome to our channel, Learning Notebook. As you know, CBSE has issued guidelines to promote art integrated education and to make students aware about the vast and diverse cultural heritage of our country, India. So today, in this video, we will learn about state Punjab and you will find lot of ideas on how to create art integrated activity on Punjab. We will talk about geography, people, culture, history, dances, dresses, food and famous places to visit in state Punjab. For this activity, we need few colorful A4 sheets or a scrap file, a ruler, a black marker pen, a pencil, cut and paste picture book of Punjab, a pair of scissors and a glue. Aim of this art integrated activity is to understand the people, culture, history, geography, dances, dresses, food and famous places to visit in Punjab. Punjab is located in Northern India. The capital of Punjab is Chandigarh, which also is the capital of Haryana. Now let's learn about history of Punjab. History of Punjab is as old as Indus Valley Civilization. Hinduism existed in ancient Punjab, while Sikhism started in Punjab region during the 15th century. Though Akbar supported Sikhism, but his successor did not support Sikhism. And considered Sikhism as a threat. So Sikhs fought against Mughals and later they fought against Britishers. Nobody can forget the Chaliyawala Bag incident in Punjab where hundreds of unarmed civilians were killed by the Britishers. Now let's learn about languages spoken in Punjab. The official language spoken here is Punjabi. Hindi is also a very popular language here. Now next is people and culture of Punjab. Punjabi culture is one of the oldest and richest cultures in the history of world and it is also one of the most vibrant culture. Sikhism and Hinduism form the major religions of the state. Now next is Geography of Punjab. The word Punjab consists of two words, Panj and Ab, where Panj means five and Ab means water. This name was given to Punjab to symbolize its five rivers. These five rivers are Satluj, Bias, Ravi, Chenab and Jhelum. Only Satluj, Ravi and Vyas rivers flow in today's Punjab. The other two rivers are now in Pakistan. Now let's learn about famous places to visit in Punjab. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel, 
then do like share and comment on our videos also do not forget to subscribe to our channel learning notebook the first famous place to visit in punjab is amritsar it is the spiritual capital and a major pilgrimage spot for the sikhs some famous destinations of amritsar are golden temple jallianwala bag wagha border etc next place is chandigarh it is the capital of punjab and is the first planned city of post independence india some of the top destinations here are the rock garden sukhna lake rose garden timber trail etc next place is ludhiana ludhiana is the largest city of punjab and is located on the old banks of satluj river next place is patiala It was founded and ruled by the Jat King Maharaja Narendra Singh. Patiala is famous for traditional salwar suits with loose pants, pagri and paranda. Now the next place is Bhatinda which is famous for its historical association as it was Bhatinda Will Guru Gobind Singh challenged and fought the Mughals bravely. Bhatinda is famous for the robust fort Kila Mubarak. The last place is Pathan Fort. Due to its geographical location, Pathan Fort is the meeting point of three states: Punjab, Jammu and Kashmir, and Himachal Pradesh. It is surrounded by rivers Ravi and Chaki and it is also surrounded by the Shivalik ranges of the Himalayas. Now let's learn about famous religious places and historical monuments to visit in Punjab. When one talks about Punjab the first place comes in the mind is Golden Temple. Golden Temple has daily footfall of over a million people from all around the globe. It is known for its beautiful architecture, the golden walls and the large compound which is surrounded by beautiful lake on all the sides. Next famous religious place is Akal Takht which means throne of the timeless one. It has great significance to Sikhism and is certainly one of the most important location for Sikhs and all other tourists. Next is Jallianwala Bagh. It is a beautiful garden to pay homage to hundreds of people who were killed by the Britishers and it signifies peaceful coexistence of people of the modern times If one is visiting Punjab then you cannot miss the Wagha border ceremony It is a curious border closing ceremony which takes place at sunset every day It is a beating retreat ceremony which involves a heavy display of who stepping guards from the indian border security force and the pakistan rangers saluting each other lowering and folding their flags and closing the gates at the border next place is rock garden which is the true example of best from waste as all the statues displayed here are made from industrial waste An interesting fact about this rock garden is that it was single-handedly built by a former road inspector of Chandigarh. His name is Nagchand and 
he built this in his spare time. Next is Rose Garden, which is also known as Zakir Hussain Rose Garden. It is the largest botanical garden in Asia. Now, another religious place of Punjab is Mukteshwar Mahadev Temple. It is a popular shrine to Shiva and it is a riverfront Hindu temple. Next place is Kila Mubarak, which is located in Bhatinda and it is the oldest surviving port in India. Now, let's learn about climate of Punjab. Punjab experiences extreme hot and extreme cold conditions. It also experiences heavy rainfall. In summers, the temperature goes as high as 45 degrees Celsius and in winters the temperature lowers down to even 0 degrees Celsius. Next is Punjab population. The population of Punjab mostly consists of Sikhs and Hindus. Now let's learn about famous traditional dances of Punjab. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel, then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also, do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. Famous traditional dances of Punjab are Bhangra, Githa, Jumar, Malavi, Sami, and Jago. Now, let's learn about traditional festivals of Punjab. Traditional festivals of Punjab are Besakhi, Lodi, Teej, Basant Panchmi, and Guru Pudha. Next is traditional food items of Punjab. Famous food items of Punjab are Makedi Roti and Sasuda Saag, Butter Chicken, Tandoori Chicken, Dal Makhni, Chole Bhature and Amritsari Kulche. Now, let's learn about traditional dresses of Punjab. The traditional dress for women in Punjab is Churidar Kurta. And traditional dress for men is Kurta 
pajama. So students, this was all about state Punjab. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.